G'day and welcome guys to the first episode of the 2022 West Oz Adventure season. This year we're going to be looking for the biggest chunks of gold in the world, which is sort of the same as every other year. We just haven't found them yet, but this year, probably a year that we're going to top the biggest nugget ever found. So stay tuned for the channel so you don't miss out on seeing that be unearthed later on this season. Uh, Nigel's not back yet. I still don't have a license but we're working on that. So I'm out here with the boys. We got Zach and Bill. Say g'day Bill. <coughs> Say g'day Zach. G'day Zach. Right so there's these blokes clowns that I'm out with today <coughs> for a week. So we've got three seven thousands giving us the ultimate best opportunity of finding that big stuff out here. We pulled up on this pending ground. It was just on the way out so it was like might as well stop give her a bit of look around make sure that old mate didn't leave any nuggets here before he pegged it so yeah we'll turn the detectors on and get the season started i guess all right guys sounds like i got me first decent signal here I have a listen it's under the ground Pretty faint, but here's to open. Will this be the first nugget of 2022? So, there's our first shotgun pallet for the 2022 season. Sure to see a few hundred more of them along the track. Here we are, sun's going down, day one, second spot, zero gold. We got a fire, which is brilliant because I haven't seen one of them for seven months. Anyway, Bill's got his mansion going on, glampshin over there. Zach is going to make a little man cave thing here with slightly less of a budget than what we got going on over here. <laughs> and then my good self is going to grab this here little bag which has a pop out bed and I'll sleep like one of them people that doesn't have a vehicle to sleep in in a, in a little pop out bed back to the old days. Anyway, she'll be right mate. Hopefully no dingoes want to eat me while I'm having a nap. So you, if you've been watching the channel for a while, you've probably seen this bed before. This is what I used when I had a little piece of crap Ford Ranger that I couldn't fit a bed in the back of. But this bed's still good. You can set it up after heaps of beers and stuff. It takes like, like, I don't know, 30 seconds to set up. You have a look at this. Chuck them legs out. Chuck that out, chuck that out. Put that bit there. And then you chuck this bit on there. And you have a bed, and you're off the ground. Chuck this on the top if you want, so you got some protection from the rain, and that's done. 
So here's the situation, it's day two. In the morning we're expecting rain tomorrow so we do get on gold now. Bill got first piece this morning, Zach got a piece. I still don't have any, I have a signal here. Let's hope this one is gold, eh? There it is guys, first piece for the season. We're all on the board now. We better put a few ounces together this week. Well here we are guys, day four. So far we haven't found a whole lot of gold. We've had to move around spot to spot. Hasn't been much to show, just a fair bit of rubbish. About six grams yesterday. Uh, we moved to this camp now. They doing all right. Boys are getting a piece or two each now, so we can start stringing a few grams together, we can make some money yet. Halfway through the trip. Anyway, I just dug this big hole. It was a real strange signal, so I thought it was going to be rubbish, but it wasn't. So down here, in that white sandy stuff, I got this piece. And that's about, that'll be over two grams. So I'm just going to do some chaining in through here. And uh, see what else I can turn up. Hopefully film a few targets. Righto, so I headed back camp to weigh this nugget that I found earlier. I was thinking just a bit over 2 grams. 2.3 grams. Beautiful. Good start to the morning. Yeah, not bad at all. Nice looking piece too. We decided to come over and have a look. Bill's got a bit of a signal. It's in the hard ground. Hope it's not that noisy black stuff. You're in difficult, eh? Yeah. Shouldn't be ground noise. Wow. Yeah, man. Jeez, that's a deadly signal. All right, the nugget's out. It's in a bit of that cap rock, surely. There it is. Nope. Yes. Yeah. What was that? A couple grams. Fucking hell, not as big oh. as I thought it was going to be. It's the biggest piece for the trip, I think. Three? Yeah, yeah. more yeah, than three. A bit over three there. Solid. Fucking rounded, too. Solid, man. Nice piece. Yeah, yeah. at least three. Fuck, that's, that's a session. Good. Nice. Good, we picked up like over five grams this morning. If we can do that two more times a day, we'll be doing good. That's good fun, Bill. I guess you're gonna do some work in this area. I'm working for <laughs> I think so, yeah. You can chain for hours with just one piece like that. discovered I got a bit of a problem. We was back at camp and Bill made us some nice bloody bacon egg rolls for lunch and it turns out I can't open my mouth because the left side of my face is really killing me. I don't know why.
good news is we're flying a little bit of gold. Bad news is my face is killing me and I can barely talk and I can't eat. There's a little nugget that I just got right there. Alright, how long have we been out here, fellas? Day four. Day four. Day four. Everyone rattling? <laughs> Who's rattling the loudest? Alright, let's tip them out and see. Bill's got the biggest nugget, as you've seen earlier. Alright, so I'll just tip my pole straight on the scales. Sixteen point two one. I think my biggest was about one of them two grammers anyway. So it was like two point three something. Well, I've had an average trip so far. Check them on. Bumps us up to twenty point nine. All right, Bill. See the big clunker. Oh, there we go. Twenty nine. 29.09 grams. A couple of species. And these two species that Bill found, amazingly, he's found the only species. Hey, that looks nice. Yeah. That looks nice. Hey, hey, this one looks nice too. Look at that. It's right through the other side. Awesome. So these things, they'll get hit with hammers and not treated very nicely until they're all crushed down in, worth money. into a fine <laughs> dust yeah but there you go we got 29 we say 29.05 grams so far for four days got a few days left so we we're looking for at least 10 grams each should be able to do that especially where we picked up half the ounce today eh? yeah we, sure. we'll drink to that eh yeah. Yeah. and hope it doesn't rain tonight I think it's about day five. So far, we got about <clears throat> 40 grams. So that's all right. Got a bit of a signal here. Alright, so this is what we got from down there. It's a little piece of gold here. Nice and shiny after a quick wash in the mouth. So we're on our last day today, haven't been finding much gold, just looking for some pending ground at the moment. And we're just driving around in here, following the maps on the uh, phone. Looks like the track ran out. And is that a track in front of us? Yep, maybe. So yeah, let's hope we can start turning them up. We're only four grams away from half an ounce each, so let's hope we can do that. So at the end of the day, we found some pending ground. There's like people everywhere, so we're not liking this much. So we thought we'd just weigh up. And we've got our 79 nuggets, three species there a trip so we're gonna split that up between the three of us and then uh, yeah just head home a bit early because we don't have much luck and we're a bit sick of the bush at the moment and we'll try again next time there'll be a special crushing video coming up soon too because we're gonna crush these species yeah, look all right. here we are doing the final weight this is the nugget obviously Got the nuggets How it went between three of us. Oh, we lost some weight. Thirty nine point seven seven. We have 